As you know uh, better than most, it's, it's re-stirred these stories mm. that there's some bad blood between you and the Chancellor going back no, through this co coalition. I mean, what do you make of this claim? Seems incredible to me mm -hmm. uh, from this new book that the Chancellor regards you as thick. <laughs> well, I heard and saw him the last couple of days saying uh, it's completely untrue. But honestly, you know, I've been in this politics long enough. I've had plenty of insults, General thrown at me. The Chancellor and George and I are very good friends, and I don't believe that he's ever said this. But honestly, if anybody out there believes that kind of thing, that's fine. I'm in good company. You know, Mrs. Thatcher was told she wasn't intelligent enough to run the country, <laughs> and uh, Winston Churchill was told he wasn't intelligent enough. I, I, you know, I want determination and drive. We've got a job to do, and uh, I'll let others debate levels of intelligence. So he doesn't think you think. I, no, absolutely not. But then, you know, I wouldn't mind either way. I'm really quite relaxed about it. Well, I'm glad that we've uh, clarified that.